we found 100 single women who are dating, all of whom were over 65 years of age. And we asked these over 65 single women, would you go out with a man if you knew that all he was interested in was sex? <laughs> How many senior citizen women said they would go out with a man anyway? Well, I go out in the middle with that, I say 50. But the thing is, I think they probably think themselves lucky if they could get any sex, you know. <laughs> so, but I, for the sake of this, I'll say, I'll say 50, yeah. Somehow I knew that would be Pat's answer. Don't ask me why. But I, he says 50, Terry. What do you think, higher or lower? Well, I think that uh, senior citizens over 65 are still a little Victorian in their beliefs, so I'm going to go lower. Ah, lower. The actual number of senior citizen women who would go out with a man if they knew all he was interested in was sex is 14. Very ah! much lower. Terry, I see that. Terry has gone that very well and has a nine. Oh, I want another one, Jim. Of That's course. not a great card we'll at all. change it to oh, an Well, eight. not That's, much better. That's okay. even less great. I'm going to go higher. Higher than an eight. Oh, oh three. Oh. Higher. Champion gets a free chance to play a two. Oh, higher. Higher than a two. Oh, higher than a king. Lower. lower than a king. Lower. Lower. lower than a queen. A five. Higher. You're going to risk it for the first game of the match. Higher. All you have to do is give him half a chance to sneak in there, Terry. Wait, wait, did you cut those cards, Terry? I certainly did. Well, then don't blame him. <laughs> Here come the next cards off the top of your decks. And we'll start game two with a question that goes to you, Terry. Let's hope you cut them better for this game. And remember the cards that have been played. It is often a help. Terry, we asked 100 single women. Would you accept an engagement ring from the man you were madly in love with if you knew it once belonged to his ex-wife. How many single women said they would accept the engagement ring anyway? I wouldn't. So I am going to say, that's really playing bad. I'm going to say it's low, and I'm going to say 20. 20 would accept the engagement ring anyway. Somehow I'm interested to see what Pat's reasoning is. Pat, what do you say? Well, you know, ladies being what they are, I think a lot of it depends on the price of the ring. You see. So, um, she said 20. 20, yeah. Well, I think, I think it's got to go a little lower. Lower? A little lower. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the actual number of single women who would accept the engagement ring is 14. He's right, it's lower. <laughs> and back. You start off game two with a oh, two uh, again. Higher than a two. A higher jack. Lower. Risking it lower than a jack. A two. Oh, yeah. Higher than a two, a ten. Where can I go? We're going to hold it there. Freeze. Hold it right there and freeze. We move over the freeze bar. Pat needs one card for the championship and another crack of the money cards. Pat, this question goes to you. Pat, we found 100 geniuses. Now, these are all people whose IQ is above the genius level. And we asked them, while you were in school, did you ever cheat on a test? How many geniuses admitted they have cheated on a test? They probably got their genius rating by cheating a little anyway. So, uh, yeah, I would say that uh, geniuses cheating on chess, um, 50. 50 geniuses have cheated on a test, Terry. I, I think if a genius has been talented, you know, has been given that God gift of a brain, I'm going to say it's going to go a little lower. Lower. The actual number of geniuses who've cheated on a test is 47. It is just a little lower. Terry, you get the card. Jerry, you start this time with an eight I again. I want another card. You won the question. A change to... Oh, oh you got a good card, lower, Terry. Lower, lower. lower than a king. It is higher, a four. Higher, higher. than a four. Oh, oh, no, another four. That is a big break for Pat because he gets a chance to play off the ten and call this for the match. I would like to uh, change... You did lower. not win the question. Lower. You cannot change it. Lower. You say lower. If this is lower, Pat has the championship once again for the win. Yes, oh. he has it again. And then he wins it again. Oh my goodness. Terry, where are you running? Terry is running. Oh, come back here, Terry. You say, why are you running away? Are you that eager to go? I was thinking no. I You're a Terry, don't run. You come down here with us. Pat, would you come down here? Pat's going to play the money card. We don't want Terry to run. Stay here, Terry. Okay. See, isn't that better? Yes. 
asked you. Okay. That was really nice you of stay, you. Sure, you stay here with us because we're going to say goodbye anyway, okay. Jerry. <laughs> then we're going to say goodbye to you. That'll oh. go for the big money the next time we play card shot. I hope you had fun, Jerry. Oh, I had a ball. Look, it's a nice, it's a nice party just for you. Thank you. And you can stay here while we roll credits. Right? It'll be a great party, okay? Okay. See you next time. Back to the big money. Right back. Bye-bye. Polling groups will receive more Selectrophonics Disco Jukebox, a stereo music center with a multi-color light organ that responds to the beat of the music in a 32-inch slimline contemporary design, furnished by more Selectrophonic. And some of our contestants will receive long-lasting DuPont Blue Sight paint, custom blended in a rainbow of more than a thousand colors for inside or outside your home. Tough ceiling lucite goes on easy, looks great. And an electric knife in Unicap T high potency. The vitamin for people on the go. 11 essential vitamins, 6 important minerals, including iron and zinc from Unicap T. And be everything you can be with Mary Kay Cosmetics. Skin care and glamour cosmetics presented to you in your home by trained beauty consultants. Mary Kay Cosmetics, Dallas, Texas. And the pen set and pledge, the furniture polish that picks up fingerprints and smudges and gives your furniture clean, natural beauty every time you dust. Thank <laughs> you.